Hi, I'm Jonathan and I'm one of the founders at Lean Law. And in this video, I want to explain how Lean Law can help you, the firm operator, the billing manager, facilitate the full life cycle of all of your invoicing through Lean Law. Now, we're a timekeeping and billing platform with deep integration with QuickBooks Online. We see QuickBooks as a source of truth and we want to make QuickBooks work for law firms. I'm in the reporting page and I just wanted to show you a glimpse that says Lean Law has a slew of reports that should take should take some things you're doing manually and automate them, specifically around compensation tracking, what bill collected, productivity tracking, whether we do that by client or by user, many different reports that are very useful in the day-to-day -day operations. But I want to shift gears and talk about the billing workflow. Now time entries are captured in Lean Law along with expenses. Um, those expenses can be directly inputted into Lean Law or captured in QuickBooks Online, and they will be automatically brought to Lean Law. No manual work. Um, and those will be automatically tagged client matter when you have a single client matter. Um, but in the billing tab is where all of the work happens to get our work in progress that's captured in Lean Law out to our client. Now, the first thing I want to do is show you what an invoice looks like. I want to show you the end product so you get a sense of it. I'm in Gmail. This is a custom note that you can create for your client. So you can either have a very stock. This is the same thing we say at every client's or write specific notes. We, of course, have payment links, account summaries. Uh, in this instance, there were some there was a, a payment automatically paid from retainer. So we're putting that nice statement on um, the invoice will show uh, your logo and all the different things. But if there are that payment retainer information will be transactionally here on the invoice as well as in a full trust activity statement. All of that's automated. I wanted to show you what it looked like at the back end. And so you could see that they could your clients can pay um, electronically through that invoice. But let's now look at how we get to those invoices. We're in the first section and I want you to orient yourself to this upper left area. This is how we generate bills and there's typically three steps. Ready to bill is all of the time that's in the system. Of course, I filter that by what period I want to bill for. I can, you know, check things in macro or in micro, produce a single bill, or I can produce bills in produce draft bills in bulk. Once drafts, once the drafts are created, we typically ask our attorneys or stakeholders to come in and edit those drafts. Now, some of you folks won't ever come into it and do a live edit, so we do have a print function. But for those that um, are willing to do it live, we can just simply click into a, a particular invoice. We will see who's responsible, who the originator is, what the invoice total is, um, what the client balance is if one exists. Uh, this happens to be a fixed fee and an hourly. Um, the attorneys, if they see something wrong, can or you can change the matter quite easily. I have full editing capabilities, including write downs. So maybe I can only bill the client 12 hours. The client will see a reduced rate or reduced amount based on that number. Maybe the client doesn't want to bill it right now and save it for later. They, that pushes it back to WIP and we can bill it at a later time, um, including the entire draft invoice. When it is deemed ready and, and I'm able to go to the client, we click approve and that communicates to that billing clerk, that office manager person, hey, that's ready to be billed. So let's look at now that our invoices are approved, how do we get them to the client? I'm going into the manage invoice section. So this is where the meat and potatoes is of what we do day to day in managing our invoice. Of course, I have a series of filters here to manage, manage the day to day or filter down the data. What most folks do is say what's not paid and first look at their leads if they do leads billing. If they need to grab a leads file, we will see those leads file and we can deliver that leads file out of Lean Law by simply clicking that and it will produce that leads file. Let's say there's trust activity happening. I can say, show me those that are not paid with trust, trust and in batch pay with trust or individually pay with trust. And it will make a full payment or partial payment depending on how much trust money is available. It will also handle all of the back office accounting for you. So there is no manual work in terms of how you handle the bookkeeping. And as I showed you from that invoice, all of that will be articulated on the invoice and with the trust state. Once we know that all of our clients are ready to go or all our invoices are ready to go, I can simply use this function to say, show me non-paid and those that are ready to email. Ready to email means that those have been deemed ready and we simply say deliver 
and LeanLaw will deliver those emails in batch for you. If you want to print, we just say, show me the ones that are ready to print and you'll get a batch there. I hope I have some in, in batch. I'll print those as a uh, right download as being combined as PM. So in this tool, we're giving you different ways to look at what's paid, what's overdue, what's not paid in terms of managing it. Now, if I use this email function, this allows me to write that custom note uh, that I showed you earlier and add payment links or invoice payment, just essentially customize a specific invoice for. Now, once the invoice has been delivered, I might want to track sent emails. So we've delivered them via email. Now I can go in and look at who's opened, what's been clicked, what's been delivered, the different states of it. If I want to send a reminder, I can do so, whether I do it individually or in. Um, uh, so in the, this is the general overview of how a day in the life in Lean Law would be in managing all the invoices for your firm. Thanks so much for watching.